Hey guys, so today we are a Christmas pudding. And as you can see, I've already clean filled my hair and sprayed it black and done the black outline of my face. So I'm just prick sticking my eyebrows and getting them as thin as I can to the skin so you want them as flat as possible. And then we're gonna go straight in with our white aqua color paint. And we're just gonna do the whole top half of the actual face. And um, this is activated with water, just remember that. Don't worry too much if you go straight over those lines that you've just done because they were just like an estimated line so you can go back through. I haven't done them too thick so I can still see them. So I'm going in with my brown aqua colour paint mixed with the yellow so it creates more of that glowy effect like a golden sort of colour rather than too chocolatey. And I'm just going in on the outside as well all around the edges and then I'm creating the sort of drips from the icing. And then you're going to take the black and you're going to go around those edges to create a bit of shading. And then grab a bigger brush just to blend it all in. And then you're going to grab a stipple sponge with that black and you're just going to do it all over that brown. And this just creates all the effects like the raisins in the actual uh, pudding itself. And then you're going to grab a smaller brush with the red, you're going to draw on those berries. And then you're going to use the green to represent the uh, holly. And then you're just going to use the yellow through the holly, just to give it a little bit of 3D-ness and a little bit more of the leaf look. And then you're just going to get the black and you're going to go around the outline again just for the shading effect. And you can blend that all in. And then you're just going to grab your stipple sponge again with the yellow colour this time, just over the top. Again, it just creates a little bit more colour and depth into that Christmas pudding cake. And using that deeper brown, just a really small amount on your brush and you're just going to go around the outsides just to create a little bit of shading. But not too much on your brush so you can mix a little bit of the white in with it if you like. So finishing any touch-ups and then you have your Christmas pudding. I hope you like it guys and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did please give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment or subscribe and you can see all my other videos and I'll see you next time. Bye!